Katie Fix. Today we are going vegan. People choose to be vegan or sometimes have to be vegan for dietary reasons. And one of the hardest things about vegan would be having to give up cheese. I want to help you guys out. So I've got here some cashews ready to make some vegan cream cheese. It's always nice to try new foods, isn't it? Let's try some foods. So I've got here 250 grams of cashew nuts and I'm going to cover those with filtered cold water. Challenging. Done. I'm then going to cover that with some cling film and I'm going to pop this into a fridge for at least four hours, but ideally overnight. Oh, I made some earlier. And here you have them. So these have been soaking for about six hours. They have lost their colour, they've gone quite light. And I've just rinsed them and drained them and that's all we need to do. So the next step is to introduce you, as you will become very familiar with on this channel, as she's made at least three appearances, or if not has some to come, Maggie. This is my 32-year-old Magimix a pride and joy of the family and just shows how damn good Magi Mix is. No, I'm not sponsored, but I would love to be. Hey you, with your steely, blendery skills. How's about we make some Magi Mix? Some magic mix? So she has got unbelievable force and power and we're basically gonna chuck our cashews into a blender and into this nutritional yeast. Now nutritional yeast is uh, used a lot in vegan alternatives. Uh, it's what gives that kind of nutty, cheesy flavour to a lot of dishes. So we're gonna go for two tablespoons. The juice of one lemon. I've got a lemon juicer and I freaking love lemon juices. Half a teaspoon of salt and a splash of water. Right, on she blows. Now you're trying to... She's okay, she just doesn't like... She likes to be held as she works. You're wanting to get this as smooth as possible, so you may need a spatula to like scrape down the edges and just keep going. It can take up to five minutes of blending. So stick with it. You've got this. That is looking smooth. Really nice consistency and it smells good. Okay, it is time. What goes better with cream cheese than a bagel? So I've toasted some off. Time to put this to the taste test. And I'm actually gonna finish it with a little sprinkle of chive as well. Oh my goodness. That is delicious. So it is very like cream cheese. What it has that normal cream cheese doesn't have is a slight, slightly more sweet to it. So maybe a bit more salt, but that, oh my goodness, that's so good. <gasps> if you like this video, let me know in the comments box below and give it a thumbs up if you fancy too. Don't forget to subscribe. I'm here every single Tuesday doing all sorts of dishes. Nothing's off limits, so let me know if there's something you want me to try. I will give it a go. And until next time, thank you so much for tuning in. Bye! Honestly, so good. <laughs>